Europe is growing closer together. People regularly travel to neighbouring countries for work and leisure. However, regional trains are still organised on a national level. Borders are hard to overcome. EU's Interreg programme Northwest Europe is making an effort to install new short-distance international train lines. The project in charge of this is ROC. It's about uh, four new international rail connections between five European countries. Connection Eindhoven-Düsseldorf, connection Eindhoven-Aachen, so both between Netherlands and Germany. Connection between Maastricht and Hasselt, so that's then the connection between Netherlands and Belgium. And fourth one we call Transmorsch Metro, and that's the connection or a new rail service between the north of France and the south of England. The biggest problem is that nobody is responsible for it. Yeah? You have two systems, they work fine, you know, Netherlands, they have a very good railway system. And then in Germany you also have a good system, but they don't interconnect. Huh? They just stop next to each other and nobody really thinks how they can work effectively together. It's simple, we have a border region but the border is still something uh, which has to overcome uh, because in the train sector the border is still a hard border it's not a soft border there are at present no direct regional train links between cities across the belgian dutch and german borders some lines run only in one direction and some are not even electrified this means that cities such as herlin are cut off from major european centers Rock will change all of that. A rock project means uh, regions of connected knowledge, and uh, it's connecting the knowledge region Eindhoven and the knowledge region Aachen. Heerlen is a station on that track, so we try to connect uh, via uh, an intercity connection uh, these two uh, uh, regions. The first intercity line will connect Eindhoven and Aachen, followed by lines from Maastricht to Hasselt in Belgium and from Eindhoven to Dusseldorf, connecting these cities as well as centres of the European economy. ROC managed to put up most of the 280 million euros investment required. In addition, ROC intends to introduce lines from regional France that will connect with the Channel Tunnel line to England. For all of this, project leader Gustav Weber has a dream. The vision for me would be that it would be like flying. huh? You don't realize that you're crossing a border. 